Hello Libra, um, it is Gabriella here. I don't know why that card's in the middle, but anyway. Um, this is a general love and relationships energy read um, for you today. I hope you enjoy it, I hope it resonates. Um, there have definitely been some interesting things going on for the other star signs. Um, there is a lot of lesson learning at the moment, I've found a lot of releasing the past actually to move forward seems to be a bit of a theme that's occurring at the moment so there's definitely something in the air there for everyone there is definitely some uh, some stuff to be released before moving forward so libra what is going on for you guys oh we've got the queen of swords again oh temperance okay Wow, okay, so you guys have got some really strong cards here. We've got Temperance, the Queen of Swords, and the Ace of Pentacles. I'll move these down a little bit, sorry. Um, let me show you. So we've got Temperance, Queen of Pentacles, and the Ace of um, Pentacles. They are strong cards. They are very strong cards. I feel like most of what's required at the moment uh, is patience um there is definitely definitely patience required here um i feel like there's a you're waiting on someone right now i feel like there is definitely waiting occurring um i feel like seeds have been laid foundations have been sort of temporarily um placed down um you know things like this i feel like small moves have been made to to say how you're feeling um and now we just need to be patient we need to take time and we need to kind of release the situation to the universe a little bit um within that you are very strong in who you are and in your power right now you are very much um determined powerful strong and who you need to be um and that is absolutely wonderful don't stop being that but just remember um patience you can't force this situation and this situation needs time and it needs to play out on its own this is not something you can control right now um and if you can release um expectations there is a chance for something really beautiful to be created there's a beautiful chance for a lovely lovely outcome here but you can't force it if you force it you risk ruining it so definitely definitely make sure that you're taking time keep focusing on you keep doing you and take time out um to let the situation play out as it needs to um and i do feel like this is going to be a bit of a slow process i feel like this will take time but that is not necessarily a bad thing i think too many people rush situations now um so don't be afraid to take time don't let fear get in the way of this situation okay what else is going on for Libra wow okay you guys have got like huge cards coming out right now so we've got the ten of pentacles a hierophant and the sun now wow okay right I want to lie these over the top because I feel like these are relevant to what has just been laid out so bear with me Okay, so we've got the Knave of Cups, Seven of Cups, the Fool, so Three of Swords, Two of Wands, and the Seven of Pentacles. Now, I do feel like these overlap. So, let's have a feel. Right, okay, so I want to come straight to the Fool lying over this hair fan here. Um, I feel like um, the person in question, the person like involved in this situation, um, may have actually voiced themselves in the past. And so they're feeling a little bit, um, hesitant, a little bit sheepish, um, a little bit unsure about, um, really taking that step forward because they've already put themselves forward before and it wasn't met 
in you weren't in the same place at the same time you both weren't on the same page um so there is hesitation here from the other person um to do with um making that step forward which is why i feel like they need this time they need to figure things out for themselves here um i feel like though there is so much potential we've got the ten of pentacles here which is you know really positive end of cycles um again pentacles is normally financial security but for me this feels like um security and expansion all around this is to do with um all of your life not just finance and it's got a really really um giving energy it's very very um i feel like you're going to be really really um giving of yourself to encourage this person so that they can see um that you meant what your what the energy you put out you meant what you said um and leading into that we've got the seven of cups which is all emotion and it's beautiful i feel like when this is accepted when you've kind of shown that you really are as invested as you um appeared then you've got a chance for a really really beautiful connection with this person um absolutely like that's overlaying here so that is their potential there um I want to come on to the Three of Swords and the Knave of Cups before anything else. I feel like, um, on your part, I feel like there will be jealousy from someone else. I feel like this will be you two um, in a union behind here. And I feel like this person is going to come forward with jealousy. I feel like there may be some text messages um some very wordy text messages um or voice messages there is definitely some kind of communication that this person is going to um put forward to you um but i don't feel that they will be in a very clear state of mind when they do this um i feel like you need to just be aware to not play into it um, I would be very aware of the way that you are replying if you reply at all um, because I feel like there will be um, rambling and jealousy from an outside party so that is just something to be aware of but your energy together with this other person is lovely there is a real newness here there is a potential there is a real gentle unfolding of a situation here um yeah there is definitely definitely connection i do feel as well coming on to this card i feel both of you are going to have people in your life that are a bit jealous um i feel like one person in particular like i said is going to have a lot more intense jealousy occurring and i feel like this one is just more of a someone looking in from the outside going like i can't believe that they've actually moved on does that make sense i feel like they're a bit of a person that's going to be a bit like they kind of think they're they're everything and um and they're not necessarily um so i think they're just going to have a bit of a moment but that's not going to affect both of you at all um and what I love is moving on from that. We've got the two of wands kind of overlapping with the sun here. Um, and it is such a beautiful energy. Let me show you. So we've got the two of wands here and then the sun. And like this energy is just pure love, comfort, joy, just a real expression of um, connection and communication. And it's beautiful. It's a really, really lovely energy. Um so yeah and then here again we've got the seven of pentacles and it just it's just lovely like i just feel like you guys are going to be so in love and together and have a real connection i feel as well i'm very drawn to this red string around her wrist which very much leads me it makes me feel very much um drawn to um the old story of the red string that um, attaches um, people, like connects people from past lives and things like that to each other. And I feel like there may be a bit of um, a deeper connection with you both as well. I feel like there may be this sense of having, like knowing each other quicker than you would expect to. Um, so it's got a really lovely feel that could be occurring. But as I say, just keep an eye out for this jealousy as well around you that will, will occur further down the line. Um, and don't be afraid of the fact they're hesitant. Don't step back just because they're hesitant. Make sure you still 
show that you're interested, but be patient. Don't force the situation. Um, and you could end up with something really, really beautiful here. So yeah, this is a really lovely reading. I'm really, I'm so excited for you guys. I think this has so much potential. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Please like, share and subscribe if you did. It means a lot to me. Um, personal one-to-one -one readings, of course, are available um, by email or phone. Uh, they are £45 and yeah, I absolutely love doing them for you guys. So there will be details in the description box below regardless. And uh, yeah, lots of love. Take care. And uh, yeah, I just, I'm kind of looking forward to, to hearing more about this, guys. I think it's lovely. So enjoy, embrace it. And uh, yeah, just be a little bit more patient. <laughs> okay, take care. See you soon. Bye.